Welcome back, welcome back to our weekend saxophone tutorial. As you may know, saxophone instructor by name Biatax. Um, to take us further this week, we're going to be talking on how to slur. Yes, slurring technique on the saxophone. Now, what is slurring? If you may ask, if I may ask, likewise. Slurring is a technique that actually tells us how two closely related notes can be played as one. Two notes sounding as one in same beat. So now, what are those um, slurries? There are notes that are slurries, and there are notes you cannot slur. Now, notes that you can slur are as follows: your T to your do. This is my slurring um, arrow. You can slur your T to do. You can slur your D to re. You can slur re to me. You can slur me to fa. You can slur fi. To song, you can slow Z to La, you can slow to to T. Now, this note T do can as well be written as this T do, but this is going to take um, two different beats. It's going to sound as but because of this class, it's not going to sound as T do. When you said T do, that is two bit. T do, that is two bit. Now we want it to sound as one. Now sounded like T do, T do, T do. Then next note is going to be dre, dre. Then ri mi, not ri mi. It's going to be ri mi. Mifa, Piso, Zila, Tati, then Tida. This has got a sound on the saxophone. Um, this is key C on the saxophone. Is it? It's different from sounding as. Now, from the saxophone here, there are chromatic um, alternative notes, uh, keys that you need to actually know. I can do my T to do like this, but it's not going to be as fast as when I add my um, side C to my B. I can play like this. It will not be smooth as when I hold down my B and add my side C. I'm very smooth. That's smooth and very, I'm very fast. So it's going to sound like. Then next note is D. I hold out my C sharp here and I move to Re. Not. It's gonna be. Then Re to me. You're gonna sound out. Not. Then Mi Fa. Fi So. Zila. Toti. Now, look at the tone I use here. I use my. Um, Auxiliary B flat here. Tati. Then Tido. Very simple as this. This is um, slurring. Of course, now I, I told you how we can actually um, apply it. Okay, I told you we are actually going to apply it on a song. Uh, okay, either one or two songs. Now, for instance, we all know about this song. Pass me not a dead to Savior. Now, here I'm going to apply it now. Now, the note for the songs is this. The note is. Now, from this point now, let me play how it's going to sound like when we are um, 
playing it on the saxophone. Songs 
of your own. Um, try many other songs on your own and um, make sure you get back to me on my comment box if you have any problem, if you have any challenge in actually doing um, this uh, um, slurring technique. Trust me, it's a very simple thing. Just take your time and go through it. Because if you've not um, subscribed to this channel, I don't know what you're waiting for. Just make sure you click on the subscribe button and click on the bell notification beside the subscriber. I still remain a silent voice instructor by me, Jan Sachs. See you next week in our next um, class.